It's the referee will get us off and underway. Bradley Allen very shortly inside the uh, Emirates. It's a real different feel this season to the Emirates to in previous years. The atmosphere is really buzzy. Expectation is high for another victory in this one. And we're about to get off and underway on BBC Radio London's. Long time to be in there and challenging. Is that a foul? Well, the referees wave play on and Zahar's darting down the left-hand side of the Palace attack. He's inside the Arsenal penalty area. Wilfred Zahar drives it! It's bounced off the post and then goes to safety off the back of Aaron Ramsdale. That could have gone anywhere. Ben White now approaches the point of the 18-yard box, threads it through towards Saka, whips it into the path of a little drive for Martinelli! Arsenal eventually take the lead. Ben White winning the ball, created by Pakaya Saka, and Martinelli with his 13th goal of the season. Comes to the point of the penalty area. White to Pakaya Saka! 2-0 to Arsenal! It was relentless pressure for three or four minutes and eventually the Crystal Palace back line broke down. As it's rolled forward to Granit Xhaka, touch off to Trossard, Xhaka again! 3-0 Arsenal! Granit Xhaka set that up, rolled back into his path by Leandro Trossard, cutting through the Crystal Palace defence and Arsenal get their third goal of the game. And Granit Xhaka this time was in there to just dink it over the top of the onrushing Whitworth. It's Arsenal 3. Crystal. Paddy McCarthy is here, comes the corner kick. Michael Elise will take it. Heads go up. Bounce down his six yard box and jabbed home. And Crystal Palace have the goal. Who's going to claim it? Edson Edward, maybe. Possibly Jeffrey Schlupp. He's getting the applause and the handshakes. And Crystal Palace back in this game, at least with a goal for their team. Fans to cheer for to the D. Looks to loop it towards Tierney. Tierney's got a chance now. Drives it left footed. Swept in by Bakaya Saka. Fourth goal of the game. His second of the match. Tierney with the creation. And Arsenal restore their three goal lead. And Bakaya Saka gets his second of the game. The thing is about games in hand, you have to win them. You have to get the points as the referee blows the whistle. And it's another victory for Arsenal. It's a three goal advantage they've got as well. 2-0 up at the break, thanks to Martinelli and Saka.